It began over 20 years ago, serving children who otherwise would slip between the cracks and miss out on the joys of a hearing life. We celebrate with them and share the warmth of their stories. And it's an effort that continues. We didn't know she was hearing impaired until she was five years old. And the reason we knew is because she was not talking properly. I mean, I've been in school, you know, you know, in and out, in and out. It was very difficult, you know, to understand it. So um, I felt like I missed out on a lot of stuff in high school, you know, and my first year in college. That was one of the reasons why I didn't stay in school. Fortunately, our, our, our economic situation at the time was not the greatest, and when we find out that she needed a hearing aid, it was just a big expense. Today, we launch the new Miracle Ear Foundation. We've revised the guidelines, process, and eligibility so that more stores can participate in giving the gift of sound. I look forward to the opportunity to help adults in our franchise area that have exhausted all possible charity resources and demonstrate personal inability to financially provide for hearing health needs. Our Miracle Ear hearing specialists across the U.S. share their experiences and excitement about the growth of the foundation. I have a child, um, he's been with me for many years. Now he's driving and it, it's crazy that he comes to my office without his mom now and it's just him and it just, it's rewarding to see him uh, evolve from this shy little boy to this man now. She made my life different, way different. My hearing aid make my day happy, and able to hear every single day is big. If I didn't have hearing aid, I would be lost, that's for sure. The Miracle Ear Foundation helps children and adults succeed in school and in life. We hear from children and from parents how Miracle Ear hearing aids help their family. I talked to the teachers at school when I first found out she was hearing impaired and they told me about the Miracle Ear. Well, she was so happy because she could hear. She was a little girl, but she was happy. She was dancing. She was like, like with a new toy. Well, she's more outspoken. She wants to do more things. She wants to talk to friends. She wants to go and do things with them. I would be upset if I don't have hear my hearing aid because I wasn't able to understand them and I wouldn't be happy in my life. So. Without them, I stutter a lot and I annoy people because I can't finish my sentences without stuttering and a lot of times I can't hear them. And fortunately, she was able to find Miracle Ear, and uh, the rest is history. These are the stories that move us to help those in need in our community. The Miracle Ear Foundation relaunch is ambitious. With your help, we want to double the number we serve with the gift of sound. We want to use the foundation as a platform for education in our community. And in order to serve more children and adults, we want to help fund this program through donations and fundraising. I found that people in our area genuinely want to help others, and they're really open when you ask them to support a program that they can really see the results here in their own community. People who experience the joy of hearing would like nothing better than to share that gift with other people. So I believe very strongly that yes, Miracle Ear patients will reach out and they will help others to get that joy of hearing too. The Miracle Ear Foundation, with their donors, provides tools that empower underserved Americans with hearing loss to enhance their life experiences with the gift of sound. Law, she's my inspiration of hearing aid. I might think follow her career or maybe in computer electronic make uh, hearing aid better. So I want to help. To our dedicated Miracle Ear stores and partners, we say thank you. Together we will remove barriers that keep people from listening to life. Thank you for giving me the gift of sound. They've helped me a lot through life, you know, improving my hearing. Just like it benefited my child, it'll benefit a lot more kids with their foundation, with their hard work. And that's something that we can be thankful enough to, uh, for getting your help uh, for Diane. Thank you so much for giving me the gift of sound. Thank you.
thank you. Big hug, just and kiss it uh, mentally. I don't know. Thank you, thank you, thank you.